Hey everybody, this is Chris. I am here to play an accessible version of Sonic. Now, just like with the accessible version of Super Mario, well, I don't really like it. But I'll play it for Sonic the Hedgehog. A little while. Play Sonic the Hedgehog. So play. Help. Exit. And help exit. Help. Now, arrow down to read help. Let's just look at a little bit of the help. Sonic the Hedgehog is the flagship franchise of Sega. Sega? Yeah, okay. The 2D Sonic games are side-scrolling platformers, starring Sonic, the Blue Hedgehog, whose main ability is his incredible speed. Actually, let me see if I can slow this down a little bit. Uh, uh -huh. Press Enter to return to the main menu. Oop. Okay, now go speed past on cyborgs. Oop. Well, press Enter. Sonic the Hedgehog is the, the 2D. Use the arrow keys, or A, S, W, and Z to direct Sonic. Press the space bar to jump. Oh, the space bar to jump. Sonic moves by trying to accelerate in the specified direction. However, the success of these attempts is dependent on the slope of the track on which Sonic stands. Slopes are defined using radians. So the closer the angle is to 0 0.5 times pi, the steeper the slope. Yeah, okay, I don't get this. The steeper the slope, the more Sonic will have to work against gravity to move along it. Sometimes, gravity will win, and Sonic will fall down the slope. In some cases, falling down steep slopes is a good thing, enabling Sonic to attain greater speed for climbing a steep slope further along the track. Okay. If you want an audio indication as to the length and angle of the current section of track, you can press T to have Sonic's flying fox buddy, Tails, fly along the track. And that just plays some audio that pans. Hold left or right shift while pressing T to change the direction that Tails flies. Press T again to make Tails stop flying the track. Yeah, and you hold left or right shift to choose the direction. Okay. You can also hear a quick sound representing the surrounding slopes by pressing L. These sounds will play automatically whenever you move over a different slope. Okay. Sonic will have to do more than just speed his way over various slopes, however. The evil Dr. Robotnik, or E.G.G.M.A.N., or whatever his name is, is Sonic's mortal enemy, mostly because he constantly tries to take over the world or small portions of it with his robotic armies. At some point, Robotnik thought it would be cheaper to add cybernetics to the locals rather than build and power robots from scratch. So you have to fight cyborgs? So, Sonic must contend with the roboticized hordes. Luckily, all it will take is a well-placed spot from above to break Robotnik's control. Most of the time, anyway. Okay, so I guess you have to jump on these things. Sonic is protected by golden rings that are scattered throughout the zones. So long as Sonic is holding one ring, he cannot be killed, unless by falling in pits, being crushed, or drowning. Okay. When Sonic is hit, he will drop all of his rings, which will scatter into the environment. If you are quick enough, you can catch dropped rings before they bounce off into oblivion. There are also various items, in the form of computer monitors scattered throughout the zones. These monitors can be broken by jumping on them. There are other methods, but they'll come in later. Beware of water. You'll know when Sonic has entered or left water by means of a splashing sound. Sonic will gradually run out of oxygen while underwater. You'll know when Sonic is close to drowning, as the music will change to something ominous. Sonic can regain all of his available oxygen by jumping out of the water for air, though keep in mind that some tasks require spending a good deal of time away from the surface, so be careful. So there's water? Okay. Most levels will end in one of two ways. There will either be a goal post, which you must run past to complete the level. Or there will be a boss fight with one of Robotnik's contraptions. Each boss behaves differently, and it is necessary to develop a strategy for dealing with them. Once a boss is defeated, you can usually find a roboticizer, with a button atop it. Jump on the button to release Robotnik's captives and complete the zone. Okay. The exception is the final boss of each game, who, rather than guarding prisoners, usually controls the fortress where the battle takes place. Defeating the final boss almost inevitably results in the ground crumbling, in which case Sonic must run so as to keep ahead of the destruction. With any luck, this will lead to completing the game, and not an anticlimactic death by pit. That's most of what you need to know to play. Other than game controls, you can use page up and page down to adjust the volume of the background music, tab to change the output mode, the left and right brackets to adjust sloppy speed, and... If you'd prefer that vertical position be represented by pitch rather than volume, or if you just want to mix it up from time to time, press Y. Vertical pitch, okay. Press R to hear your total number of rings. Press A to hear your rings. You can also stop and observe details about the current section of track, or the items and enemies in the area, by pressing V. You can hit V to view stuff, I guess? Okay, now go speed past some cyborgs. Help. Okay, let's... Exit. Oh, whoops. Let's, uh... Uh... Start menu. C. C. Documents and settings administrator. My documents. Okay, okay, Sonic okay, the okay, Hedgehog. Okay, okay, Overview okay. list. STH.S7 of 7. 
Okay, load the... Start C. Unknown. Exit. Play Sonic the Hedgehog. Right, Press play. enter to begin. Alright. Green Hill Zone, Act 1. Okay. So I guess that's a ring. So yeah, you can turn the, down the music. Yeah, I don't get this game. What the heck? Whoa, whoa. Um. I have no idea what I'm doing. Um. Um, let's hit, uh, T. But, uh, right shift and T? Yeah, I don't... Rings. Oh, you hit R to check your rings. Yeah, I don't get this game. I'm sorry. You have one lives left. <clears throat> Green Hill Zone. Yeah, I don't get it. Ooh, ooh, oh, well. You have zero lives left. Green Hill Zone. I guess those are rings, those things are... Yeah. Ooh. What? Game over. Yeah, well, you guys wanted me to play this, so I... I really don't get this game. <laughs> do do. Press enter to begin. No. No, I don't want to play again. Oh, crap. Play Sonic the Hedgehog. Exit. Unknown. Sonic the Hedgehog. Anyway. Sonic. Um. Startment. Yeah, let's close that. Startment. C. Document. And program C. Doc. And now C. Document. Ooh, ooh, I think that crashed. Taskbar. Desktop list. Recycle bin. Anyway, that is uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. And Shut up. Um, Selected. Yeah, that is Sonic the Hedgehog. That is the accessible version, and I don't really get it. Um, yeah, but you guys wanted me to play it, so I... It's one oh, there's your time announcement. Um, but yeah, so I played it, and... I'm sorry about what happened yesterday with uh, Entombed. I tried to play it and uh, well everything worked except I forgot to capture the output of Skype so um, whoops my bad so I will redo that at some point but um, yeah until next time I hope you've enjoyed this demo of me failing at Sonic the Hedgehog and until next time bye